similarly to the scorn poles we found in the foothills of Midgard ages ago. Plus. Yeah, I see the Oh. Well, considering how Spartans are made, it's no wonder you turned out as you did. Your fate was sealed from the start. Fate can be overcome. I used to think so. When the Norns told me of my son's death, I thought I could change it. You know well how that worked out. The Norns. The fates of these lands. That's right. You defy prophecy at your own peril. Shit. Oh, so want to montar, bro. anybody in nobody can Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to a fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. What? I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no champion of the giants. It is one Gore concealed. Because of this champion, the realms are saved at Ragnarok. Only Asgard falls, and Odin with it. So all this time... Odin's obsession with every detail of Ragnarok, he's been missing a crucial piece. Oh. Atreus will not be a part of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? <laughs> is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. You never know when someone will come along and cut it short. Ini hutan banyak reruntuhan, seperti. Yang sudah ditinggalkan ribuan tahun. Hmm. Nah, air itu air. 
Can you swing that torch to the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path? <laughs> Anyone alive be squeamish about war? After all the gods you've killed. I have seen enough war to know the cost. And I don't? After the price I paid to end one? Look around you, Kratos. See what happens when we don't fight a true evil. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. I don't know if they can blow it up. Ragnarok will not bring back what you have lost any more than killing me. I am reaching my limit for enlightened platitudes from you today. Can you please just shut up and kill things? Saya butuh HP bukan beginian. Hmm. 
Ah, lá, tem. Do not tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me, and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. Suara ayam Let's go It's just past those doors up ahead There I feel the source of the magic Keeping me in Midgard What is this place? My home I was born here Hold on. Something's not right. Opin Bera. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Ah! 
The hardest boss. It's 
It's over. It's, it's really over. And now that you have what you seek, I suppose this is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. Have you decided? can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry that it'll always be. It'll always be angry. But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Look. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Not to me. I do not regret saving your life, and never will. But the choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice. That I am myself again. I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Let me live with that for a moment. We can take this way back to the camp. I can help with the vines. Now embed your blades into the glowing vines and light it. Your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to go back to how it was. Leaving the responsibilities of leadership to me. Hmm? Yeah! <laughs> 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 
send Odin my regards. You use your anger effectively. Well, you learn to use what you have. It's not as though I want to be angry with Freyr. He's my brother. He was the most important person in the world to me for half my life. These plants are the same as those we saw earlier. Frost should make quick work of our poison. Well done. Watch out, those are wisps. Powerful manifestations of runic magic. <laughs> is home again after all that's happened and Hardy are in Vanaheim? We learned the Giants rescued them from Odin and brought them here. And look. The sunlight wakes the sleeping roots. See how they stretch to welcome the sun? Beautiful, no? A far cry from the sheets of Midgard snow I've grown accustomed to. The Eastern Migration. It's just as I remember it. At least the whole realm hasn't fallen to predators and occupiers. I guess there's still something to be fought for here. Something to defend even after so much damage has been done. Maybe that goes for Freyr, too.
so much has happened since I last saw Freyr. I'm not even sure where to begin. What do you want from him? An apology would be a start. I want to forgive him. I'd like to think he's changed. He's all I have left now. Did you ever apologize to Demos? It is difficult to seek forgiveness when you feel unworthy. Now how to get across? My sigil arrow should be able to carry the fire. <laughs> Forgiveness can be powerful, even for the unworthy. My wife, Faye, taught me that. Hmm. Well, be glad you have a spouse to remember fondly. Uh, heck, what is that? All my former spouse taught me was that there's no limit to the depths to which a soul can sink into darkness tricked me into marriage to spare my home and took my home just the same. Scattered my people to the wind. Maybe it's time somebody drew the line. Maybe it's time someone makes Groa's prophecy come true. I will not wish for war, Freya. War is a terrible thing, Kratos. But some things are even worse. You know, if Atreus rushes to Ragnarok, you may not be able to stop him. I will. And if you fail? I have prepared him to survive without me, if he must. Watch for the plants. They like me, but strangers not so much. I see that. You won't be able to damage it without destroying the mother. It's a large bulbous thing. You can't miss it. So what's next for you, if not preparing for war? I do not know, but I will take no chances with Atreus. Well, you may want to think fast, unless you want someone to make that choice for you. Ready? As I ever will be. It really is you. 
You've returned to us at last. Yes. Uh, let's celebrate. You reclaim the throne, we'll rebuild, me and you against the world. Huh? Just like the old days. I'm... not staying. I don't understand. You're here. Maybe together we can take back what's ours. I only just got back what's mine. I still have work to do. You've seen what's left of the realm, right? Do we really mean that little to you? You question my loyalty? Vanaheim turned its back on me. Oh, you still can't let go of that old fight. It was my duty to save as many of our people as possible. My responsibility. One you didn't take seriously then, and from the looks of it, one you don't now. You think this is a game to me? Yeah. <sighs> we lost everything to that maniac you called husband. The man's family set me on fire. How did you expect me to react? Like my brother. Like the boy that used to have my back no matter what. And who I always supported no matter how selfish his choices. I expected you to come and find me. That no matter how hurt or angry, you wouldn't abandon me. Please. I thought you were dead. Yeah. I had to live lifetimes with those last awful words I said to you. Have any idea what that's like? Knowing that your own selfishness hurt the person that you cared about the most. Abandon you. Oh, Freya. I mourned you. Oh, I missed you so much. And I, you envy. But I won't bind myself to another realm when I finally have my freedom. I'll send help, though. And I will come back. I promise. This hasn't been your home for a long time, has it? Do what you gotta do. All right, all right, that's enough. Ain't y'all got nothing better to do than gawking at family sorting squabbles? Come on, you two. Not you. Got a few things to square with y'all. First is you collecting your spare heads. Second is that sigil magic I smell on your boat. Reckon that's an idea I'll steal. How's about I set you up with some sonic mojo? Call it a trade. Very well. Third of all, if and you ain't staying here, Bears mentioning its injury and I find ourselves running a flop house for unemployed gods. If you're done freezing your backside off in Midgard, maybe come back with Beardo there. Check up on your old pal Tyr. That's kind of you, bro. I may do just that. Well, all right then. I'll meet y'all back at the house. Lesson you want me to fix anything up first. Well, brother. Here to meet our new allies, or shall we depart?
suppose that big fella we're traveling with might want to help me with a thing? Mayhaps. Now and again, he's in the mood to make What is it? Yeah, I spent a lot of time tinkering up and down the river delta. Once Owen's army came to town, I lit out of there faster <laughs> than a tassel worm with its bottom ablaze. I was so frazzled, I accidentally left behind a few irreplaceables. What? Irreplaceables? Well, just one, really. An orb. I'd be mighty grateful if you would find it. What is it? And if you come across any of my old, beautifully rusted armor pieces, I'll use the scrap to whip up something specially suited just for you. What is the orb? Just bring it back here and you'll make me happy as a sunbeam. Oh, and don't forget to keep an eye out for my old armor. I'll fix it up for you. Free charge! Mm. What sort of orb do you imagine we're looking for, brother? I do not know. Very good. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel, and share our videos, and good.